Hi, this is Natalie Tan, and today I'd like to talk to you about going green. I'd like to give you five quick tips that you can implement in your store so that we can help save the environment, but at the same time resonate with our clientele. We all know that millennials are very much concerned about the environment, and justifiably so, the future is theirs. But so are boomers. They're concerned for their children and their grandchildren. What happens in 20 years, 50 years? Will the earth still be the same? Will the forest still be there to enjoy? Now, we've heard about the devastating hurricanes that come, flooding, landslides, forest fires, corals bleaching because of the warmer water, and so on. Now, what are some of the things that we can do? After all, 70% of boomers and millennials say that they are so much more concerned about the climate now that what they do in terms of businesses that they patronize and the products that they use should conform to the values that they have. Now, what are things that we can do? First of all, think about how we all come to work. Do you individually drive cars? Maybe you could encourage carpooling or taking the transit. Well, I now try to take the transit wherever I go. Now, secondly, separating our wastes. We do this at home probably already. We separate our papers from plastics so that they can be recycled. Organic products go to the organic bin so they can be composted. What about uh, paper bags versus plastic bags? I know the cost of paper bag is higher than plastics, so maybe ask our customers whether they even need a bag. What about light bulbs? There are now incentives that are provided by local governments so that we can change into energy-saving light bulbs. Paper. Think about the receipt that you hand out to your customers. Do they even need a paper copy? Or can it be emailed to them? Or at the very least, can we micro-print so that we use less paper? Now, some other things that we could do is also encourage each other to use reusable items, even things like water bottles uh, instead of using plastic. Maybe we could keep on reusing uh, BPA-free water bottles or even metal ones. There are so many things that we can do in our store. Now, for more of these, join me on February 25th at the Alberta Gift Shows for more ideas on how we can go green.